So oh, I picked up the Go Play uh, Game Traveler Pack from Target. I believe this is only a Target. I'm not sure, but it comes with a few things. So 40 bucks, but buy it mostly for this. I don't have my my um, tripod is broken right now, so I have to record and use stabilization software to fix any shakiness so i'm using i have i'm recording with one hand right now but this is the reason i purchased the pack and i should have brought my switch over here but i can do that if i pause okay so now i'm back and here it is on there. This isn't going to fit in the dock, unfortunately. It has that thing on the back, which will be an issue with the dock. It's a little concerned. It went on very easy. It just clips right on. It has three clips, or is it four? Four clips. Two here, two here. Um, and it gives you a nice little grip, although it seems a little like offset, like it's going this way a little. But we'll see. I'm going to use it, and then after that, I'm going to come back. But I am going to show what the other stuff. This is just hold your game cards. It's be handy to take with you. So you get two of those. I believe they hold four cards a piece. So that's eight cards. Get a another one of these. I have a million of these, and you get thumb caps. Um. So you can put these on the switch, um, switches, some thingies. <laughs> and then you get this case, which you can put all this stuff in. Possibly even more. I should have opened this. Hold on one second again. Ah, it was already open. Anyways, uh, then we have in here, we have all the compartments for these things, including the... This, let's see if this fits in there, if the switch fits in this with the, with that. Let me turn this off. Um, turn it off. And then, let's see if we can close this. And yeah, I think we can close that. Okay, so this will fit in here with that. And you have this for whatever you want to put in here. And then we have, yeah, so I guess you can have compartments for everything. This feels sturdy enough. It does feel like it moves a little bit. But that's if I do this. So I will come back and talk about that. So, so that's everything that's in there. And that's $40 at Target. So, you'll come back and tell you what I think. All right, I'm back. I used this thing for a few hours. And I played some Doom. I even played some fighting games and some retro games and yada, yada, yada. Um, I put on the thumb caps. These were actually a pain in the ass to put on. Um, I was afraid I was going to break the analog sticks trying to put these on. They didn't stretch around it right. And if you don't put it on, on right, they'll fall off. So, and also, I imagine if you play these for a few hours, your your thumbs may start to hurt, depending. It seems to be a little uncomfortable. Uh, also, this one blocks you a little from hitting the B button and sometimes causes you to push up on this stick, thus moving a camera in the wrong direction or whatever. So you may want to get a different cap, something a little more... Uh, slim and less, you know, like that. I wonder if this actually fits. No, no way. <laughs> Probably glue it on. <laughs> Anyways, so uh, a couple things I didn't mention with the case. Um, here on the back is... A, I accidentally hit something on my camera. 
uh, there's a spot here. It, it leaves an opening so that you can use the kickstand. So the kickstand comes out. Also, the controller, this piece, acts as a stand itself. And you can slide the Joy-Cons outwards out of here. So you can stand it up um, in tabletop mode with the case on and use it that way. Um, and I also, uh, it's very hard to hold this camera like this. I need to get a better, I need to get a working tripod. Buy a new tripod. So, another thing I didn't mention, I didn't realize until I opened this. I think it even mentions it on it. Yeah, it says it right on the front of the box. It comes in each of these, comes a micro SD card case. So you can put a micro SD in one of these and put it in the cartridge case thing. Or you can just take that out and put another game in there. And it comes with two of these with one of uh, these in each. So that's good. Another thing is it's very easy to take the switch out of this um, and put it back in. So even though it doesn't support the dock, even though you can't put it in the dock, it's so easy to, that you can just pop it right out and slam it, slam it in the dock and break everything. <laughs> now you can just put it right in the dock. It's very easy. So taking it out, putting it in is very good. And uh, let's see. I think it's in there. So if you're trying to take it out, it's easy. But if you you can't accidentally knock it out. Uh, well, I'm sure you could. But I almost feel like you'd be trying, in which case it wouldn't be accidental. But whatever. Anyway, so I also put some other stuff in this case with here. With the switch and everything that comes in it. <laughs> Um, when, you know, I was testing that out, I can't do it now, but I was able to fit a battery pack that was like the size of a wallet in here and a cable, um, no switch dock, of course. Um, what else can you put in there? You probably, I was thinking of something else. I don't think you could drop the, the pro controller in there. I don't think that's going to work. Then, then you may just break your screen. <laughs> um... But other than everything that's in there, like the cloth and all that, you probably put a set of headphones in there, you know. Probably some headphones. And that's about it. Um, bits everything I need. Uh, I don't think you could put your... your uh, you may be able to, but I don't know that you could put your Switch uh, AC power adapter in there, though. Maybe, but I don't know. Um... But if you have, like, a portable charger or something, probably do that. So that's what I put. I put a portable charger in there with a cable. So, that's that. Other than that, when I was playing with this, it was all right. There is a little play here. So when you move it, it does hit. You do feel like a creak. Try to get that up. So that exists on both sides, and there's, uh, see if I can actually turn it, there's like a, um, you can see light through there. Sorry for my voice, I, I'm i getting over a cold, and uh, it's still not, my voice is still not back, but I think that's about it, so see if I'm actually missing anything, I don't think so. Oh, it has. It also has a spot for your Joy-Con straps in the front. So, right here, you can put your Joy-Con straps there. And this Velcro's down. So, that's that. And you put these in here. Those. Oh, you know what? I think that's the AC power. Right there. Maybe. I believe that's where you put your power adapter. Let's see if it says it on the box. Oh no, only car charger. Does it say only? Yeah, only car charger. Yep. It's a spot for a car charger. Because it's supposed to be a travel case, so... They assume that you're going in a car with it, but... That's for a car charger. So you put the car charger goes in here. Wires go there. 
But uh, that's it. I mean, maybe you could fit, it, fit the AC adapter, but that's about it. Thank you for watching.